And a TikTok user is going viral for a unique skill. He can find out the game playing in the background of any TV show. Here's an example. Take a look. I was re-watching Daredevil, and in the last episode of season two, Foggy meets up with Karen at their favorite bar, Josie's. And during the conversation, you can see a hockey game playing on the TV at the bar, so of course, I had to figure out what game was on. My first clue was when I zoomed in here that you can see that the players are wearing full cages, which to me indicates college hockey. Then you can see at center ice that there's a giant S, which made me think Michigan State Spartans. So I looked up their rink, but it seemed that most pictures had a Spartan logo at center ice but if you went further back they had a big s logo there from 2008 to 2009 that shrinks down our window a bit but who were they playing well if you look right here it sure looks like these jerseys belong to the ohio state buckeyes so that means it's one of these two games between ohio state and michigan state and i know that it isn't the saturday game because this says that it was broadcast on fox sports detroit and their scoreboard on tv looked very different than the one that's on the show so that means the game that was playing in the bar in Daredevil was this one that happened on February 13th, 2009 that Michigan State won in a shootout. Wow. Yeah, how, isn't that amazing? Yeah. That is Ian Arugio and he joins us live no. this morning to explain how he does all. Ian, how you doing? Good. Good. So this is like a long time hobby of yours. I know it just kind of blew up on TikTok. How did you start doing this? You know, it's something I've probably been doing for close to a decade now, and it's just like a fun joke between me and a buddy of mine. And uh, yeah, when I started making videos about it, uh, people kind of liked coming along on the journey. And you're getting a ton of requests. I, I know you've blown up on TikTok. What kind of things are you getting? I mean, TV shows, movies, video games. Like, uh, it's it's been crazy how many how many uh, shows actually have these things going on in the background. Wow, and have you been stumped yet? Do you got any where you tried and you failed? Uh, I wouldn't say failed. I haven't figured it out yet. But there are some that I have in the background now, put it on the back burner and try and like, you know, hopefully I'll figure it out someday. And I will say watching these, um, I, you know, it's really cool you're doing this with like sporting events and backgrounds, but you seem to have a really good investigative mind. Would you ever consider putting this to use in other things? Like, hey, maybe, Call the FBI or something. They could use somebody <laughs> like you. Yeah, I mean, uh, if they ever need my help, I'll, I'll, I'm, you know, glad to to give a hand. Uh, as long as it has to do with sports, I'd probably that's my focus. <laughs> but uh, we'll, we'll see. Yeah. And so, where are you gonna? I guess where do you go from here with this? You're just gonna keep doing these videos on your TikTok? Yeah, we'll just keep trying to figure out as many as we can. Excellent. Hey, well, thanks for joining us this morning. Uh, I know we'll keep an eye out on all the shows we watch. See something weird, we'll send it your way. Sounds great. All right, Ian, uh, thanks again. You can check him out on his TikTok page. No Problem Gambler is the account. Thanks for uh, joining us this morning. Thank you.